Hello everyone, welcome to Beauty in the Garden, I'm T. So in today's video, we're gonna be planting up a great and another amazing crop. And I'm excited to grow as many as I'm gonna be growing this year. I have plans to grow at least 40 this year. So let's see you guys if I'm gonna be able to maximize my space to grow all these beautiful crops that I'm gonna be planting up this season. So right here in front of me, I have some pre-sifted soil and as well pre-moistened soil. I did show you guys in a great deal of videos on how to sift your soil. Sifting your soil will help your seeds pop out that soil very easily so it does not have any sticks or stones to hinder them germinating and getting their way up out of that soil. So what we're gonna be doing today is planting up one of my favorite crops. I like it raw, I like it fried, and I definitely love it in stew. So this is what we're gonna be planting in today's video. It is okra. I hope you guys really like okra because this is what we're gonna be planting today. I'm gonna to tell you guys some of the varieties that I'm gonna be planting in today's video. Before we actually go ahead and jump into this video, Right here in front of me is pre-moistened soil. So we wanna make sure that our soil is sifted, okay? And as well, pre-moistened, where it holds together like a brownie and crumbles apart. We do not want our soil to be soaking wet, okay? So what I'm gonna be doing is heavily sowing them into these cells right here. This is a six cell pre-used tray that I had from some flowers and I'm gonna be using it in today's video. So if you have any kind of container, anything that might hold some soil, head you guys and jump into this video. The first one that we're gonna be planting up is the Okinawa Pink Okra. It is a beautiful, stunning okra, you guys. Check that out. Now this pack of seed is from Rare Seeds and go to rareseeds.com, Baker's Creek and you'll find this particular variety, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and put maybe eight, I'm gonna put eight, okay? I'm just gonna make some uh, little indentions into the soil, maybe a half an inch or so deep, okay? Here's what the seeds look like. All of them are gonna look pretty much the same, okay? So I'm gonna sow eight, an inch deep hole. Just like this. All right, two more six, I'm gonna do one more in here. All right, so we got eight, and that holes are roughly about a half an inch deep. And I'm going to show you real quick. If you guys can see them in there. Okay. Alright. And then I'm going to go ahead and tag it. Please make sure you tag you guys. Make sure you tag. I'm telling you tagging is it'll help you in the long run all right so we have an okinawa pink planted the next variety of okra that we're planting up is the hill country red that i picked up from in my gardener he has a great site as well and he is another youtuber um, but uh, this is the variety that i'm planting all right we're going to do a half an inch hole Oh guys, a stick slipped on by. All right, so we got it half an inch deep. Just like this. All right, I'm gonna put that back. All right, that was a country hill. The next variety that I'm planting up is the red burgundy 
uh, okra and this one as well is from in my gardener like don't over pack your seeds in here but you definitely could over um, you could definitely uh, overseed it okay with multiple ones because we're gonna go ahead and prick these apart when it's time to plant them out they actually are going to grow pretty quickly in these containers but by the time they get to the size that I want to prick them out, it'll be time to pull them out in the garden. All right, so that right there was the burgundy. All right, the red burgundy okra. The next one up is the Fort Hook Farms Star of David. Okay, this is the Star David okra. This is from Burpees, all right. Let's put this one here. It's a country all right nice side seeds on that these are really big all right one two three four five uh oh a piece of something got in here no i thought it was a stick it's not okay one two three four five six seven eight half an inch holes please make sure there's a half an inch hole because okra has a tendency to get real spindly at times so please make sure that you do plant them a little bit deeper okay that half an inch will work for you okay matter of fact let's see what they said they actually prefer that you plant them an inch deep i i actually prefer to plant mine a half an inch deep um let's see if any of them else says Yeah, half an inch to an inch deep, so yes. All right, so that one right there was the Star of David. All right, the next one up is the Clemson Spilus. This is off of my seed shop at bybt.com. If you're interested in purchasing my seeds, go at the top of the screen, it is three bars. Go and stroll down to Beauty in the Garden and you guys will see my seed shop. If you guys are interested in purchasing seeds, from me so this is definitely on my website all right and I'm going to be planting up a lot of these okay my husband prefer the just the plain old green ones so that's what we're going to be planting a lot more of okay so we're going to be planting 16 of those right let's see here y'all let me know in the comments what kind of dishes do you guys like um, okra in and let me know in the comments if you like to eat it raw I actually like it raw it is super healthy for you as well great for the digestion so Still got a lot left, okay? All right, so now what we're doing is just covering them over. All right, I'm gonna cover them over. I gotta make a tag, you guys. I'm gonna make a tag. Where's my tag? Uh-oh, I'll be right back. I gotta grab my tags. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I have my tags. And this was the Clemson Spineless. Yep. <laughs> all right, so we got those all planted and tagged. Now I have here my sprayer. I love this thing. I'm just gonna water them in. You just want to settle the soil so that the seeds touch directly onto your soil. You don't have to um, just water it because you already use pre-moistened soil. You just spray it, okay? Just like this. I'm just 
like the soil off my tags. <laughs> All right, so here we go, you guys. We have our okra planted, multi-sown, and we're gonna be pricking them out and up potting them. Go ahead and plant them out into our garden. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I do upload a video. And let's get these spring gardens ready because I am definitely, definitely ready. And like I always tell you guys, remember, there's beauty in everyone's garden. And bye-bye for now.